again a welcome to meet us. It is really a great pleasure to be your first again today. Thank you very much, uh, Luke. I must say that I always feel very much at home when I'm here in Belgrade and uh, I would like to thank you once again for the warm welcome you have uh, once again given to me and uh, all my associates to the whole Greek delegation. We had uh, our talks today. I also met uh, yesterday with uh, President uh, Boris Tadic. And, and I want to stress that uh, our talks are always based on absolute uh, sincerity, on great trust, and on the feelings of uh, friendship for each other, which are very well known. I želim da kažem da su naši odnosi i razgovori uvek zasnovani na potpunoj iskrenosti, velikom poverenju i prijateljstvu. It is a long-standing friendship between not only the political leaderships of the two countries, but also between our two peoples, and I think this is the most important thing, and a friendship, and I would like to stress this, that is proven in difficult times for Serbia. Želim također da kažem da je to jedno dugogodišnje prijateljstvo ne samo između političkih lidera naših dvije zemalja, već i između naroda koje se posebno pokazalo u teškim vremenima. And it is exactly in this spirit that we today discuss the situation taking shape in the wake of the recent ICJ advisory opinion. I upravo u tom duku smo danas i razgovarali u vezi sa nedavnom situacijom i u vezi sa mišljenjem Međunarodnog suda prava. First of all, I would like to say that we discussed this issue also past Monday in Brussels with my European colleagues. Također želim da kažem da sam ovom pitanju razgovarao i prošlog ponedeljka sa mojim kolegama u Briselu. And part of my mission, my visit here today is also to convey the prevailing thoughts within the European Union. Union after conferring also with uh, Catherine Ashton, the High Representative uh, of the European Union on Foreign Policy and Security Issues. There is of course uh, no point in hiding the facts that uh, the views expressed in Brussels do not always share a common point of uh, reference. <coughs> Regarding uh, Greece's position, our position is well known and has not changed. <coughs> At the same time, I want to stress that uh, there is unanimous agreement on something in uh, Brussels. That uh, the region's future lies in the European Union. That uh, regional security and stability are served only by everyone's dedication to the objective of uh, European integration. This is what we supported in Brussels, what I personally also supported in Brussels, and this, this is what I came to date to support also in Belgrade. I to je upravo ono što ja i lično podržavam, što sam podržao tom prilikom u Briselu i što podržavam ovdje u Belgrade. With regard to the ICJ opinion, I would like to say that uh, it sheds light on certain legal aspects of the matter as requested by the UN General Assembly. And we believe that the United Nations is the natural forum to which the discussion of this issue should return. And, and the aim is to create a process of dialogue between Belgrade and uh, Pristina, a process aimed at making headway on the course towards the European Union and improving the lives of 
all the inhabitants of the region. I would like to close by stressing something that I assure you did not go unnoticed by anyone in the European Union and uh, that everyone appreciated greatly in the discussions we had uh, last Monday in Brussels. And this is the maturity and the responsibility with which the political leadership of Serbia is handling the matter. And uh, I think this is a clear indication of the will to accelerate Serbia's uh, European course. Finally, let me also mention the memorandum of understanding that we have uh, signed today here in Belgrade. Greece is uh, ready to provide uh, know-how in every sector regarding the European accession process of uh, Serbia. I think it is uh, an important uh, substantial step, but uh, it is also very symbolic. Symbolic that uh, we believe profoundly in the future, the immediate future of Serbia and the European Union. And I would like to repeat once again what uh, I hope that uh, everybody in Serbia already knows in this respect. And uh, that on this path for the European Union, Serbia and the Serbian people will find Greece always at the side, actively as a trusted friend and a trusted partner. So once again, thank you very much for the hospitality and also this uh, very constructive and sincere dialogue we had on all the issues. And uh, as always, I'm looking forward to welcoming you once again and very soon to Athens or to Greece in general. Thank you very much.